In this video we're going to look at how we're going to work with decimals and multiplication. So if you were given something like um, 3.2 times by 2.9, then we can't just run scared from it. One thing you've, you should really get into the habit of doing is can you determine what the answer should be close to? So 3.2 is close to 3. 2.9 is close to 3. So it should be close to 3 times 3. So our answer should be something near 9. So that should give you a hint as to where the decimal point should go right at the end. When multiplying with decimals, ignore the decimal point. So instead of doing 3.2 times 2.9, Look at just 32 times 29. So we write 32, 29, draw our lattice. Okay, so we've got 2 times 2 is 4, 2 times 9 is 18, 3 times 2 is 6, 3 times 9 is 27. Then remember we're looking at the diagonals. So we have 8, 4 plus 1 is 5, plus 7 is 12, write the 2, carry the 1. 6 and 2 is 8, plus that 1 is 9, and that's just 0. So at the moment we've got 9, 2, 8. So we said beforehand that we should be getting an answer close to 9. So the decimal point must go here in order for that to be true. 9.28 is quite close to 9. Another way of making sure that you get it right is by counting the number of decimal places you have in the question. And it should be the number of decimal places you have in your answer. So in the question, we have one decimal place and two decimal places. So on the right hand side we should also have two. So that makes sure that the decimal point is in the correct place.